and uh, so that I don't forget, I don't know whether Mushmila Makela is here. I've had um, the instructions given by Mushmila Jeptumo uh, to him, and I want to assure you, Mushmila Jeptumo, um, that I will make sure the instruction that you have given him. The first uh, proposal that comes from uh, Baringo North, I will uh, make sure that. Uh, it carries uh, your instructions. Um, let me say that I also sit in the in the board of a CDF. So actually, the the interim chair of the national government uh, CDF is the one standing here, and I'll make sure that um, Michael, whatever he is. Is a friend of mine. I'll make sure that uh, that instruction uh, is carried. Um, I want to say this, um, read these uh, instructions. Um, it's a letter that's written to the principal of the school, um, Ozen Girls High School, B.O. Box 19, uh, Cabernet, through the county education, the, the county director of education, uh, Barigo County. RE elevation of the elevation to national status. It is the policy of the Minister of Education that every county should have a, at least two national schools, one for each gender. National schools admit students from across the Republic as a way of promoting national cohesion and unity. The County Education Board, Baringo, recommended the elevation of your school to national status. This is therefore to inform you that Osen Girls has been upgraded to Girls National School for Baringo County. After the request for the, the request of the County Education Board was approved. It is therefore expected that the school in consultation with all education organs and stakeholders will put in place necessary structures to enable the school to operate as a national school. Sign Paul Kibet for principal uh, secretary. So I've come to confirm that the letter that you received was genuine. You know there are things that are flying around in, in the social media. And I think I, I once, I think I saw this letter uh, flying around. So I've come to confirm to the community that um, is it that the person who signed the letter is the one who is here. So I've come to confirm that this is genuine, and the reason why it took long has been said by the ADMP. We were waiting for your performance to reach a level where it can attract students from across the country. And then from two, uh, 2018 up to this year, I mean up to last year, the school was struggling. But there was a breakthrough uh, sometimes um, last year. And uh, we were we were happy to say that uh, the school can then um, proceed to be a national school. And so a decision was made that to the school be elevated. And there are many things to say. Congratulations, Osen girls. Now I want to request that um, I now go ahead and read the, the speech by the PS, um, Ministry of Education, uh, State Department for Early Learning and uh, Basic uh, Education. To the, to the area bishop, uh, the governor, chairperson of the board of management, uh, all senior government officials and the leaders, the chief principal teachers, all our invited guests, students, and I mean parents and students, um, uh, good afternoon. It is my pleasure to join you uh, in today's Thanksgiving as we celebrate your good performance uh, in 2021 uh, KCSC. This day has been occasioned by commendable uh, performance and uh, therefore, we want to take this opportunity as a ministry to congratulate 
uh, the candidates of 2021 uh, and the teachers also for enabling the school achieve uh, stunning performance. I also want to appreciate the members of the uh, community, the staff, the, both the teaching and non-teaching staff for the role they have played to ensure that this school achieves uh, its uh, performance. It is noted with appreciation that uh, 82 of the 98 candidates who sat for KCSC last year uh, scored C plus and above. That is 83%. Um, and therefore will be joining the university. And I want to pause and uh, appreciate one of the students that I was told and I was able to award this even, I mean, afternoon. I'm told that I came to this school with uh, less than 300 marks and uh, managed to score a B plus. So I want to say congratulations, uh, members of the teaching staff for a job uh, well done. The establishment of this school and this growth to five stream under the sponsorship of AIC is an initiative whose wider strategy was the expansion of the girl child uh, education opportunities. And I want to again appreciate the old men who, um, who stood here, the pioneers uh, led by Ms. Nelson Mandela for a job well done. Congratulations. The gesture sends a strong call for all compassionate Kenyans to support education as an enabler of socio-economic development. This should be the way to go of, of Kenyans of goodwill. Ladies and gentlemen, allow me to again I congratulate the school on its elevation to national status. It is worth noting that for the, for the school to have been elevated, uh, a lot was considered. One of them was the performance, uh, the other one was its capacity to grow, and number three, its willingness to accept uh, the new status. The school mean, uh, improved from 5.56 uh, to 7.4, which is applauded. However, the new status comes with expectations. It will attract students from across the country uh, who will come with a lot of expectation and therefore, you will be expected to compete uh, with your other giant sisters, like Alliance Girls, Fangani, Moy Girls Celebrate, to name but a few. So the expectations of all these people around here is that you are going to uh, march victorious and uh, walk shoulder high to be like the other school. We want.